Paying attention. Old Cornwall had a deal with the state. He was being paid to develop the region against the federal government's wishes as they didn't want problems with the Indians. Anyway, so we get it when we're done? We're almost free? Yes. If we're right. We've had tough times. The toughest of times. But come on. Don't doubt me no more. It's that door at the end on the right. Search the place. They got a somewhere. I don't know. I've been here before. Check that cupboard by the door. We got some cash. How much? I got him. I got him. I got him. This is it. State bonds. How much? It's a, a few thousand dollars worth. Maybe more. <laughs> oh, we are nearly there. Arthur, we're nearly there. Mr. Morgan, let's go home. Let's get out of here, Arthur. Should be. Come on. We need to go. You. You ran away. Oh, I did no such thing. Don't be a fool. They could be back here any minute. We did it, gentlemen. Well, we got some money. And with the train job, well, we got a whole lot of money. Come on. Everything is coming together. Exactly as I planned. I've got to take the boy to his father. As you wish. Usually he is nowadays. Sure. <clears throat> Come on. We got to get back to camp and prepare. Let's ride. I'll be back when I can. I'll stay with you. And me, of course. And so will I. No, get out of here. Please. This ain't going to be nothing nice. Be safe, Arthur. All right, come on. Let's get him to what PT as fast as we can. Hold on, my friend. Men. Uh. We must go back for the bodies. We will. Save your strength. My friend, I'm sorry. About this, about all of this. You have nothing to be sorry for. You know... Dutch? Dutch is... I guess my thinking is he used you. 
He wasn't trying to help anyone but himself and his own crazy principles. We're grown men. Nobody made us do anything. Maybe I'm talking for my people as much as for yours. We saw he turned crazy and... and we couldn't believe it and we followed him anyway. They should never have gone this far. You seen the situation on the reservation? Better to die fighting than sick and weak. Maybe, but you... Your people deserve better. You okay, Charles? Not really. All this death, and for what? Just so we can have enough money to be able to run away from what we've done? There used to be some... some reason to it. Lines that couldn't be crossed. We even helped some folk. Those lines have been gone for some time now. The time has come for us to draw our own lines, Arthur. Decide where we go from here. I swear, back there, Dutch just stood and watched. If it wasn't for Eagle Flies, I'd be... I know. I feel like he's descended into the kind of man he told us never to be. Maybe. He's just become more who he really is. I don't know him. I just feel like a fool. That money, those bonds, whatever it is, I don't want a cent. There's too much blood on it. Let's just get this boy to his father. Your friend here, my friend, he's a brave man. Fearless. Always has been. This won't be in vain. We will try to round up more men from the north. Wherever we can, many are ready to fight. Bring him to me. My son. <laughs> 